Hello, and welcome back to a Coaster B Diorama Overview. Um, and in this one, we'll be taking a look at um, a build from August 2021. I think this was made by Vertex. Uh, let me take a look at his uh, workshop. Um, but it's been a bit since we've, you know, taken a look at all these overviews. Um, and yeah, all that jazz. Um, but this one is supposed to be uh, a Da Vinci themed uh, flying, you know, like flying machines and all that. The machines that, you know, he made, Da Vinci did, um, which is pretty cool. Um, and yeah, he, uh, it's by Jam Lobs, Jam Lobs, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, let me turn off the controls. And yeah, it looks really cool. I really like this park. Um, got some really cool stuff going on. So let's take a look here. Um, over here, we got some really nice little uh, buildings over here. Got some really nice, like, sort of pathwork here. I really like how it's, like, very patchwork. Um, and you got this little, like, back area, backwater area. Nice little buildings, like, rotating around here. It's very, very cutesy. Looks like you're missing a few poles there. Um, love the use of the cylinders for rocks and stuff. That's cool. And the little, the little boat is cute. Um, interesting way of doing water, um, it seems. Got, like, a concrete thing and then, like, a blue thing underneath. Um, got even some little effects here. And the coaster flies through, like, um, what's that one coaster? Manta. Um, I assume that's what it's based off of, which actually this is, I think this is actually a coaster that's based off of Manta. Can't tell. Um, no. Wait, maybe it is. I don't know. Um, but it, it looks cool either way. I like the pirate ships that you got here, the little shipwrecks and all that. Um, it's very cool. Um, and then over here, you got some buildings across here. You got the photo, which I assume is for, like, photographs. Can't really tell. Um, but yeah, it looks really nice. Got a nice little pathway over there. Coming this way, you got some more work. I love the use of these lattices as fences and everything. You got the Teatro La Buzzi. I don't know what that means. Uh, someone wants to translate. I love that. Um, over here, you got a little building down, I guess, into like a show building or something, or something of the sort. Um, oh, there's the entrance, that's what it is. It's the entrance. Um, I love the <laughs> river rapids over here. It's pretty cool. Um, yeah, that's, that's actually really cool. I like that. How it just sort of fly, rotates around here. And everything. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, wow! Uh, I think it goes down. I think that's... Yeah, it's going downhill. I think. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. Yeah, that's really cool. really like the custom supports as well. Custom supports are really nicely done. Um, looks like you're missing some netting. Um, maybe you were gonna do netting or something? You just never finished the staircase. Either way, looks really cool. Um, come in this direction. Got another, they got a station building, I guess, for the river rapids. That's really cool. I like the pathwork here. And the use of these pieces to get that shape that you want. Coming this way, you got even more backlot stuff. You got a little uh, hand truck f uh, crane. What are these called? Not a hand truck. Uh, crane. We'll just call it a crane. I don't remember what they're called. Um, but it's still very cool. Got a little roller coaster. Uh, Crane. That's what they're called. To get it on the tracks. Nice. Um, and then over here, you got a little gift shop. Um, got a little compass on the ground with little, some lockers as well. I'm using the chocolate bars. And you got a really cool flying machine uh, entrance thing. Looks really cool. Love how it's made out of like text and stuff. It's pretty brilliant. Um, it looks really nice. Love the flying machine on here as well. Um, nice. Got tons. Oh, these are all like little grapevines or whatever. Winery stuff. Um, got even more. 
flying machines. And then you go into a little building here. That's cool. Um, and then you get into the station. Yeah. This is an awesome little build of Jam Lobs. Um, great build. Looks like you left some of your building pieces here. Um, but yeah, very nice build. Looks nice. Got some really cool details in here. Um, boop. And yeah, well done on the submission. So, oh, it's over here. Oh yeah, River Run. There we go. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and move on to the next entry that was submitted to Coaster B. Alright, next we have Coaster Cools Gaming's submission, which is supposed to be like a temple of some sort. Um, the Temple of Thervada, I think is what it's called. Yeah, the Temple of Thervada. Um, and yeah, it's a very cool submission by Coaster Cool Gaming. If you haven't heard of Coaster Cool Gaming, definitely check out his YouTube. Make some really cool uh, videos. Um, but what he had here was a really cool little station. The station's really cool using all these temple pieces. Um, they look awesome. Or the whole build looks awesome using mirrors? Oh my god, that's brilliant. Wow, okay. Yeah, using mirrors as like peaks. Got the gyms using ceiling lamps. Okay, that's smart. Um, I'm using these skull arches as more detail. Uh, you got some wall pieces from Sci-Fi Tech. Actually, I think that might be Cyberpunk. Um, really cool little like pots and stuff throughout here. Love the whatever this is. Rock? What is that? Oh, it's just like rock texture on the bottom. Okay, that's cool. Um, just trying to figure out what it was. Um, got curbs all the way across the entire ground, it looks like, because there was maybe a fence there for some reason. Um, but yeah, you got some really cool little temples. What the heck is this? Is this a thousand pyramid? Yeah, it is. Holy. That's crazy. And it looks sick. Yeah, that's so cool. At the bottom half of a wall using the Asian pieces, that's clever. Um, some nice plants, nothing too crazy on the plants. Using the pyramid decos, it's like a little detail, that's really smart actually. It's clever. Um, using those Asian lamp posts and the crystal pattern for the water. Nice. And then over here, using the bricks for more detail mirrors, just a lot of the same pieces, some cool fantasy text pieces. This dome is crazy, what the heck? There's a billion mirrors there. Insane. Um, yeah, that's crazy. Got a little, another little building here. Nice little fountain. And you got the deliveries building. Very nice. I really like this. This is a cool build. Um, yeah. No custom supporting, but otherwise, you know, really cool build either way. Um, really like this upper area a lot. Uh, honestly, I wish that was continued across the whole thing. Um, yeah, I just really like this wooden feel. Uh, looks awesome. But yeah, really cool submission, uh, Coaster Cool. Definitely check out his YouTube channel. Um, I'll have it in the description down below if I don't forget. If I do forget, let me know and I can post it. You can also just look it up. Um, let's take a look at it at night. And... Got some pretty simple lighting. Nothing too crazy, just simple yellow lighting. Um, I do like the three colors there, but otherwise nothing too crazy. Um, so yeah, let's go to move on to the next uh, submission. Alright, next we have Das Makers. Mockers? I don't actually know how to pronounce this. Or hers name or theirs um, name I don't actually know um, but yeah let's take a look they have an uh, their description of for it is an alien airbase go to battle in the space fighter or ride the moon base boogies um, so yeah very nice uh, let's take a look at it and it's supposed to be like a moon base it seems I think as far as I'm aware and it's really cool I really like the trees trees are really nice with the like red and red colors um it's very nice i love the custom supporting you did across the whole build that's cool you got this little kids ride themed to the moon some like craters and such 
I like that. Love how cleanly that goes through. Oh, that's beautiful. That clean. That, that's clean. Got a nice little queue here with the nice little dome. Love the sort of steampunk fence you got going on with the path cross. Um, all the way down to here, down to the haulers, I guess. Um, then come over here, you got a little spaceship. Uh, got a little... What the heck is that piece? What is that? Oh, it's a metal sculpture. Oh, that's pretty smart, actually. Cool. Um, yeah. Got a little pillar and light bulb, I assume. Some totem wings. Cross here for the flying coaster. I really like this catwalk you got going on. These fences. I love, I love this uh, little brake run. This brake run is really pretty. Coming over here, you got some bumper cars. Um, which looks really sick with the steampunk fence. Or archway, I mean. Um, looks nice. Got a little nice little cube here for the roller coaster. Got a little maintenance barn, which looks awesome. Got even a Thor's hammer. A lot of oil spills in here. Um, but I love that. Love that added, added detail there. Um, looks like it, it goes under around the arrow coaster or something? Maybe? Um, like an arrow coaster. Um, got a nice little restaurant over here. And toilets. It looks really pretty. I like the use of the fence for that upper border. That's really nicely done. And then you got the entrance for the whole area, which is the Aero base, the little spaceship. Um, got a drop tower, which looks has some really nice little theming and rock work up to it. Really like how the roller the roller coaster rolls around uh, the drop tower here. And again, the color on these trees are absolutely uh, beautiful. It's crazy how beautiful these are. Um, really good color choice here. And yeah, I think that's it. Um, oh yeah, you got all this backlot area back here. It's like a little bus stop, I guess? Or maybe break room? I can't tell. Um... Uh, well, yeah. I think that's it. It's just some water over here, some nice little smoke underneath, whatever it goes under. I really like this bridge. The rockwork. Rockwork's really nice in this entire park. Um, but yeah. It's a very nicely well-made, uh, coaster. Um, or not coaster, but theme. Uh, it's very nicely done. Um, so yeah, well done, Dustmacher. Um, oh, yeah, I didn't even point out this part. <laughs> There's a whole little restaurant over here. Which actually reminds me of the restaurant from, um, what is it? Tomorrowland? Uh, right before, like, if you go into... I think it's like... If you turn off Main Street immediately, I think it looks like that. That's what that reminds me of. I really like this entrance with this... These two little spheres coming out, like a butterfly, I guess? Um, or nut sacks, whichever you prefer. Um, but yeah, it, it looks cool. Either way, it looks awesome. I actually think it's supposed to be a gift shop. I don't know. It, you know, it could be whatever you want. It's your imagination. Um, either way, it looks awesome. I love the way that you have, like, this sort of thing built up here. Um, yeah, looks really cool. So, yeah, well done on that build, and... Let's take a look at it at night. Nice. Got a few... Two bright lights. Um, but otherwise, it got some nice light colors. Looks nice. Some pretty dark in some places. I really like the custom lights you got going on. Um, but other than that... Um, yeah, I mean, it looks good. Looks pretty good. So, yeah. Good job on that. And with that, thank you guys for watching, appreciate it, um, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.